on this episode of Lapeef Let's Talk. You. Like, people shouldn't do, people shouldn't do anything because I said something. And it's like that's not how things work. Out in the street, people get slapped every day. People get run up, get done up every You're day. You're not even from the streets. Because of the you shit. You're raised in a privileged say. neighborhood. You're not even from the streets. You don't know nothing uh, about the streets. Again, I am You're not even from the streets. So again, I am speaking. So I don't care if you're speaking. You've been interrupting people up, all day. That does not negate what I'm saying. People you, it does up, negate it because you don't know what really happened in the street. Because of shit that well, they I know say. what happens in the you street. People on the internet have gotten so comfortable behind your Twitter fingers that you can just say whatever because it's not to that person's face. Knowing good and goddamn well the stuff that you say on the internet, you would not say to people's face because you would Jesus get punched Christ. and slapped in the face. Kayla, like, you're talking about happened. that, Kayla? That's what happened. Look how you talk to men. You guys are, you are so in your American, like, gushy Look how you talk place. to men. The world is a dangerous <laughs> place. Hands on another man because you think that he offended, he offended her by saying something. Fam, she gonna get you killed. She gonna get you put in a grave. You think that you playing that game, but it's too many dudes that can't speak up. They land, they land face up. Looking at that dirt, looking at that coffin, the top of that coffin, thinking that they was doing something because some chick put a battery in his back and made him feel like he was a man because he walked up on another dude. It's people that's going to say stuff, especially as you continue to ascend, as you get more visibility. You can't go up and fight every single person that got something negative to say. Walk away. Now, if your life is threatened or you feel like your family life is threatened, that's a completely different conversation. But don't walk up on no another man thinking that you tough because it might not go the way that you think it is. Y'all better calm down. Y'all better stop that, bro. Don't listen to these women. They don't even know what's best for them. Half the time you tell them what protection is then you tell them to keep your fucking mouth shut or, or stop reacting to stuff. That's protection. That's protection. Hey, don't go out there and invite certain certain things in your element. That's protection. Doing things proactively and preventing her from, from putting you in a position to where you have to go and put your life on the line for her, that's protection. Walk okay. away. Stop putting your life on the line for these women, bro, because they're going to get y'all killed. Just, if you would, if you were a woman and she think that you supposed to do some stuff like what, and she justifying what, what Will Smith did, get the heck out of there immediately. She's going to get you killed, bro. Okay, real so, okay. I, I remember my, my thought real quick. I'm sorry. Okay. Can I? You yeah, go ahead. Me? So, yeah, like I was saying, I don't condone a man protecting a woman by way of being physical with another man for saying some shit, right? However, in that particular instance, these people are actors, comedians, whatever have you. For Will, I feel like he was making a statement not just to, to Chris Rock, but to everyone else, that's been they've been getting trolled on the internet. For so now you're going to fumble the bag. What if he get his ass sued? What if he lose out on all his movie opportunities now? I what if he fumble, What if he lose on so much just because he wanted to try to prove a point and beat his chest in order to try to prove Why himself because he getting trolled? Everybody get trolled. Everybody get trolled. Didn't hear that because so, you obviously have your perspective. everybody get trolled. What if what if Chris Rock? Sued his ass for a hundred million dollars. Then you gonna say that still is that protection? I I feel like in today's oh, no 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 hold on Q is that protection? You catch that lawsuit is that protection? So again no no, no I'm not talking to you. I'm asking T I'm asking T is that protection when he fumbled a bag on behalf of trying to put his hands on another man? Is that protection? A rhetorical question. It's not a rhetorical question. Do you still consider that manly in protection when he fumbled a bag? <laughs> Listen, no. If that's the answer you want, no. Oh, okay. Cool. I feel in today's society, people oh. die for less, right? And if I wouldn't, I don't condone that because I feel like Will has more to lose than Chris has to lose, right? Especially if that bar scenario, JR said, are out. I'm not even going to tell my man what had happened till we get home, right? Because why would I want to put that ma my man in a predicament where you never know? People are holding guns. We in Texas. I don't know where y'all at, but we're in Texas. People shoot for words nowadays, right? So I feel like they got to move smart. Like, honestly, that whole clip, 
Will was laughing at first. So the whole little situation, Will was laughing at first. Jada had a little little attitude on her face. Then it just <laughs> something snapped and he went up there. But I don't I wouldn't condone that. I I think Chris should sue. Like, but the thing is about this, people keep blaming Jada. Nah, Will did that. Will took his ass up there. Both of them are at fault for this. They opened their relationship to the public. So if you do that, as I said, if you put anything on the internet, be open for at whatever you're going to get back and be ready for it, right? But I don't agree with Will. Like, that's, no, I feel like he should get reprimanded, especially on the night of the Oscars where it's freaking not really a black people show, but he got an award. All them awards that black people got that night got overshadowed because of that shit, because of that. We don't even know. Well, I didn't. I don't watch. No, not only that though. We need Q. that white validation, don't we? Not, not only that. No, I never Q. said we need a white Which, validation. You know, I'm blaming. I'm blaming. I never said we need a white Q. validation. That's that yeah, is. Yeah, so black power would have caused you to be glad all those black men got an award. Yeah, I wonder if they can't hear us, y'all. We all talking over each other. They can't hear. So hypocritical. All of those. Hold on one second. So all okay, of those people that got off, that just got Oscars that night, did they not have su successful careers before they got Oscars? I never said Oscars? that. Did I did say they that? Not va valid they don't let her cook. The let her cook. Validated her cook. them. She about to throw herself like, in, 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 the, the, in the dumpster. I purpose. never but said the that. The other thing that Ooh. I wanted to say, the hold main on, thing, on. is that I think the internet really gets people confused about like what happens outside for real. And I think the internet and guns have weakened masculinity. When men used to just handle things like men, the issue is now men don't handle things like men. Men go get guns because they're weak as fuck. Like that is what it is instead of actually working it out how men used to work it out in the 80s, right? So that's why it's become dangerous. Not because of any other thing other than people are weak. And so instead of fighting it out, they, they go get a gun. But I think also like people on the internet have this like thing that they feel like, Oh, I can just say whatever I want. There's no consequences. Like people shouldn't do, people shouldn't do anything because I said something. And it's like, that's not how things work out in the street. People get slapped every day. People get run up, get done up every You're day. You're not even from the streets. Because of the you shit. You're raised in a privileged say. neighborhood. You're not even from the streets. You don't know nothing uh, about the streets. Again, I am You're not even from the streets. So again, I am speaking. So I don't care know. if you're speaking. You've been interrupting people up, all day. That does not negate what I'm saying. People you, it does negate it because you don't know what really happened in the street. Because of shit that well, they I say. know what happens in the you street. People on the internet have gotten so comfortable behind your Twitter fingers that you can just say whatever because it's not to that person's face. Knowing good and goddamn well the stuff that you say on the internet, you would not say to people's face because you would Jesus get punched Christ. and slapped in the face. Kayla, hey, you're talking about happened. that, Kayla? That's what look, happened. Look how you outside. talk to men. You guys are, you are so in your American, like, look how you talk place. to men. The world is a dangerous <laughs> place. 